efficacy of dietary management on albuminuria and renal markers in cases of diabetic nephropathy a randomized control study by jyoti prakash introduction diabetes mellitus dm is a non-communicable disease that affects various organs of our body by micro as well as macro vascular dysfunction diabetic kidney disease dkd is the most common cause of end stage kidney disease eskd in developed countries it is thought to be a microvascular issue that impacts both type 1 t1 dm and type 2 t2 dm diabetic patients chronic albuminuria and a progressive decrease in glomerular filtration rate are the hallmarks of the condition Strong evidence suggests that early treatment of the illness can halt or delay its progression. The estimated GFR, eGFR, and urine albuminuria are two trustworthy diagnostics for diagnosis and monitoring. Adequate blood pressure management and ideal glycemia are necessary to halt the advancement of diabetic kidney disease (DKD). The study aims to provide valuable insights into the effectiveness of dietary management in ameliorating renal dysfunction in diabetic nephropathy, potentially influencing clinical practice and improving patient outcomes. Materials and methods: 200 patients were randomly selected and grouped into A, B, C, and D, containing 50 patients in each group. Group A and B had hypertensive patients with low and high protein diet given respectively for 24 weeks. Group C and D had normotensive patients with low and high protein diet given respectively for 24 weeks. 24 hours urinary albumin milligram per day excretion rate blood urea serum creatinine urine creatinine creatinine clearance were estimated initially and at 24 weeks. Results the mean albuminuria in group a dropped significantly from 170 to plus or minus 360.41 baseline to 1169 plus or minus to 76.86 24 week with ap value of less than 0.0001 with a p value of less than 0.0001 The mean albuminuria in group B increased significantly from 1706 plus or minus to 51.44 baseline to 2023 plus or minus 301.50 24th week. The mean albuminuria in group C dropped significantly from 1279.80 plus or minus 178.62 baseline to 826.60 plus or minus 186.39 24th week with ap value less than 0.0001 with a p value of less than 0.0001 the mean albuminuria in group d increased significantly from 1288.6 plus or minus 101.01 baseline to 1484 plus or minus 151.6 24th week conclusion Patients with diabetic nephropathy benefit generally from dietary protein restriction. The impact is most likely the result of enhanced glomerular permeability and selectivity and is unaffected by variations in blood pressure or blood glucose. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe our channel for watch more scientific research videos.